Okay, why is it important to change your straw in your kitty boxes, okay? Uh, this is old straw coming out of here. Now this is a really nice cat shelter in an octagon shape. And inside here, there's three levels and it's really nice and everything like that. Uh, and there's little exits and things like that in here. It's an old, old roof. It's, uh, the roof is, I think, from like 1910. And there's new straw here. But what we determined in there was the straw apparently was really nice on the first and second shelf. But on the bottom level, even though I have a concrete base down there, uh, it was mat wet and um, moldy slash musty a little bit. So uh, that's why it's important to change your your uh, cat shelter straw. And how often you want to do that is, you know, anybody's guess. I think it really depends on the environment and whatnot. Uh, this was watertight until I had an issue with the roof. That's why uh, my friend Tom up there went and put uh, some new metal and stuff on there. So that's when I said, hey, it's decide, you know, it's time to get in there. So. Uh, we're doing that and some other cat shelters on the property today. Everybody spayed neutered as they should be. If you like animals, if you like cats, it's a great program. TNVR, trap, vaccinate, neuter, release. If you hate cats, it's also good because I don't want cats all running around. So it's time to uh, deplete the populations humanely. Trap and kill doesn't work. But the main thing is really talking about... Um, really changing your straw so these are bales here uh there's four bales i got some other shelters down here on my property so um anyhow those are uh i think it was 30 some dollars for four bales and uh, my friend picked them up for me uh, and uh because i don't have a truck anymore so that's it um this is really good so and uh, that's Jonathan over there giving me a hand. Uh, he's doing a majority of the work over here, to be frank with you. And um, anyhow, best from Millville, New Jersey. Support the cats. If you like cats, don't like cats, trap, vaccinate, neuter, release. They're going to be left ear tipped. They're going to be cut. Uh, they have a rabies vaccine. Uh, there, are other, uh, there are other shots. And... Um, of course, they're spayed, neutered, and if I see anything wrong or anything, I immediately trap them and take them to the vet. If you trap a cat to spay and neuter it, remember to cover the trap immediately. Talk smoothly, don't move fast or, uh, in, and calmly to the cat. This way they're not excited. And uh, when, they're, when you pick them up, males should be 24 hours kept uh, and females 48 hours. That's assuming no complications before released. And always release them where you trapped them at. So that's it from Millville, New Jersey. Thank you for supporting the cats and uh, help shelters in your area and anybody in, engage in uh, trap vaccine new to release. It does work. There was 20, 20 cats or so when I got this place uh, almost a decade ago. I'm down to six now. So, um, you know, it certainly works. All right. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.